All right, welcome back to the Gobi Guide Zero to Hero Progression Series. Uh, this episode, I was wrestling between Agnactor or Ciadius. You don't actually need to fight Agnactor to fight Ciadius, and in fact, fighting Ciadius gives you, well, it gives you the ability to forge uh, or to obtain two weapons that are actually very good against Agnactor. So thinking about it, I would recommend that you don't fight him and instead, just go ahead and fight Ciadius first. So let's do that first. Um, one annoying thing is you're going to see the end credits. It's going to play for a long time because it's, you know, uh, unskippable. Why, why, why do devs still do this? Very frustrating. But, um, yeah, I, I don't know. I actually don't know what the fast forward button is on the emulator. Maybe... I, I don't know what I'm going to do. Maybe I'll just voice over this, so what I'm saying right now you'll, you won't even hear, but probably not. I'm lazy. Maybe we'll let it play in full. <laughs> Oi. How do people do this for a living? Just thinking about this tiny thing is giving me an aneurysm. <laughs> I know, it's like nothing. It's like really lazy. Um, my last session, I just did an hour basically solo online. Uh, it didn't amount to much, but I have a lot of stuff, and I realized I can't forge things if I want to continue my Agnactor Gauntlet. Like, I can't over, I can't go to high rank Siglinda, so I was like, okay, I better come back and do this. Oh, I have completely the wrong lands. I was talking Agnactor, Agnactor, Agnactor. Can you say that three times fast? And then I just did the wrong thing, so. Uh, oh, I already have Acris Lands. Great. Okay. I can make Doris a Spear. Honestly... It does seem tempting. Because, um... Amphitrite is, like, pretty garbage. Especially because you get, um... You get the Alatrion Gleam about the same level. So maybe I make this. This is a weapon I've never used before. And people will ask you, like, what's better, you know? Uh, red or yellow? And, like, red is raw. Well, it, the color is kind of random. But this one's raw, and this one gives you affinity. The answer is always raw. But the more pertinent question is, which one can I make? Like, at the time where I'm using it. And this one is available now. And this one requires beating C ADS. And I don't really foresee needing it. Like, I'm not going to want the red one, the better one. Like, it's just not important to me. So... If I wanted to get value out of this now, this is the one I would take. Um, the thing is, I don't think I even need that, so I, I, I just won't do anything. <laughs> I just won't do anything with it. Let's just use it as it is. The first Cadius fight uh, cannot be killed. You have to repel it. So even that's like uninteresting. That's why I don't really care about getting the upgraded version. I already ate. Okay. <clears throat> Save Moga Village. And then... I don't know, maybe free hunt a bit. Maybe maybe next episode I'll do Agnactor. So I have what do I have? Royal Claw, Spiral Lance, Siglinda. Oops. I forgot to change his mask. And it doesn't matter. You get oxy supplies. There's even oxygen bubbles on this map. So they make it like this huge, enormous deal that you have the ancient mask for Cha-Cha. And his ping ability is he gives you bubbles to breathe, but you don't even need it. There's plenty of oxygen on this map. They give you the oxy supplies. I don't really understand what they were thinking. Oh my god. Underwater camera scrolling is like, oh lord. Okay, okay. I'm back up. Get away from the flippers, by the way. Stay away from those flippers. I was getting close. And just poke the head here. I guess, I guess technically you want to poke the beard. I think that's that is the best hit zone. When you break the beard, he'll retreat to his lair, and you kind of just chase after him. This is why this fight is so god awful. Um, even after the beard is broken, like the the damage values change, but I think it's still the best hit zone. But you're gonna want a tail break. Oh my god, this is the real reason to upgrade to um, Doris Spear. Why this needing to sharpen already? I'll go for a little more. Oh, yeah, see, I'm being punished already. You know, if you have the Log Air Cruise Plates to spare, and apparently I have five, I, I think I do recommend the Door Spear Yellow. It's not, um... 
<coughs> excuse me. A latch on gleam goes right through that. Oh god. Oh lord. So there goes my green sharpness. I've just uh, clanked it away. Yeah, yeah I, I think get the door spear. So I'm doing this on hard mode. I've done a lot of this game in low rank on hard mode. Um, I haven't really talked about it, but I... All these monster gauntlets, I've mostly been doing in like garbagey sets. Like, I bring baggy sets with Lance, right? Like, they literally don't do anything. And I'm getting like pretty reasonable times. So you can see it's really... This game is a very highly skill issue. <laughs> and my times would be better if I had, you know, just armor sets that gave me more attack, uh, gave me speed sharpen, stuff like that. So, Lance can counter all of these, I guess I call it phase one, head swings. Phase one is when he's heading towards his nest to clank here. I, I think I'm just going to keep going until I really clank, because... Otherwise, I will. I might actually run out of whetstones. Okay. Yeah. See, um... Shake. Every time he begins to shake, he has humongous tells for when he's going to do the thing. Okay. Oh, oh, oh there. I'll um, sharpen when he flinches. Okay, don't clank the horn. And unless you're playing exclusively offline, or you really, really want sharpness plus one early, I I actually just recommend coming back to farm him when you're in high rank because um, while the sharpness plus one earplug set in low rank is it's good, it's really good. Um, the thing is, when you go to high rank, you're going to have no defense, because you're in low rank armor. And... Um, yeah, you're just going to get like one or two, sh or two shot or three shot by everything. So your armor skills are going to be great. And sharpness plus one is usually relevant. But, uh, I, like, alloy plus will just make your life way easier than having, like, the best quote-unquote low rank armor so yeah I, I recommend just come back here when you're high rank when you're high rank 51 because you can't even make Helios or Selene armor until then because you need conqueror seals also it is weird that I haven't uh, broken anything yet I'm so used to doing it in high rank wait what was that movement he didn't even do anything yeah, I, I haven't seen this in a long time didn't I just sharpen? Okay, there we go. So he's gonna flee back to his lair now. I'm gonna try to put some damage on his tail. Um, the chase materials for Cadius are the Deep Dragon Gem by far. It's very hard to get those for some reason. Very annoying. Um, the Crooked Horn and the Tail. The Tail, you have to break the Tail. The Crooked Horn, you have to snap the Horn and then carve it. You get two cars, I think it's 50%. And if you're seriously after them, if you're really fiending for them, um, I recommend noob carving it. And then if you don't get a horn on either of your two carves, I recommend just quit. Just uh, reset the game. Because, yeah, it's, it's really irritating. And you do need a lot of them. You need it in the hat, you need it in, uh, in Cadius, you need it in other weapons. It's a big pain. Still, no nothing's as painful as the Deep Dragon Gem, though. I think you even need two for the Barbarian Shark. And that's a really good longsword. Like, everyone should get Barbarian Shark. So, big pain. Now, so, end of Area 1 here, you get the Water Bubbles. I'm still in my Nonsense Steel set. Yeah, so, I mean, this one's not technically garbage. I do have Guard on it, so it's a real armor skill. Um, the low rank CDS parts are really good. It's used in high rank endgame even. <clears throat> so if I can afford to make those, and they're cheap, I will make them. It's the uh, waist and the boots that are super good. The boots are funny. Um, it's like, I think it's like three handy, five hearing. Or, or vice versa, it's five handy, three hearing for low rank, and in high rank, it's four and four. So it's actually the same total, 
the the low rank is literally just as good as the high rank. It's just a question of how you want the points distributed. Do you want it stacked more in one direction, or do you want it four and four? And that just depends on you know what the rest of your gear is doing. So often the low rank boots and the high rank boots are fairly interchangeable. I think it's five and three. Yeah, I think it's five handy, three hearing. Because the waist, I think, is three handy, five hearing. I think. Can you tell I've looked at this game a lot? <laughs> I spent a lot of time building armor sets. I find a lot of joy in it. I like building the armor sets. Um, for the newer gen players, they all have these like armor set searchers where you just plug in your talismans and it's like, okay, tell me what I can build. But I don't enjoy that very much. Um, because you have to like... And, and someone's built that tool for try now. But... Like... You don't know what skills you're looking for. And like, if your wish list is huge, you hit nothing. And if your wish list is tiny, it's just like... For me, you have to understand a little bit about what armor pieces give you, what kind of skills you're shooting for. And then once you have some understanding, then you can use the searcher to supplement your... Uh, your building process. Okay, I just broke the tail. You saw the debris fly off there, so now I'll just poke him anywhere, honestly. There is a scalp break. It doesn't yield anything special. It yields like a hide or something. You're gonna be swimming in hides. Like you're gonna have a million scales in hides. They're not they're not useful. So if you don't break the head, it's fine. You probably will break it incidentally, but yeah, that one's not worth anything. Yeah, so if you look at my armory, you'll see all the stuff I've collated. And, like, to be honest, like, I would say 90% of the sets are completely optimized. And then there's stuff I haven't optimized because I just don't care. Like, this is good enough. This is everything you'll ever want. Anything else would just be, like, fluff, you know? But... Starting from those base points is how I discover new armor sets if I, you know, if I even find any with armor set searcher because I know what's endgame optimal and if I want to try something novel, I know what pieces are necessary, I know what skills I want, what the bases are, and then I go into armor set searcher and see what I can do. So that's, that's personally how I use it, which is um, probably unique to me. I think most people don't like playing the armor game. Oh, I thought it was going to roar. Oh shit. I'm okay, I'm in time. Bye, Cha Cha. Is that your last stand? I think he's on last stand. Oh shit. I didn't mean to come up here. I'm gonna poke behind it. Yeah, between the eyes there. <laughs> no bouncing there. Oh, okay. Um I don't need to noob car because this is repel and I'm not about to reset for horns. Okay, this is going to be a roar. This is humongous block sun. You need guard plus one to be able to counter. Oh, I forgot. I do have guard. I'm used to not having guard. Okay, I could have countered that. Um, the fact that I came out of the block animation pretty fast shows uh, that that was guards doing. Otherwise, you get stuck for a very long time. You just get like a you get pushed back super hard. Okay, that's garbage. Very unfortunately, can I get a crooked horn? Oh no, this run is cursed. That's fucking garbage. Yeah, so uh, if it's your first time playing, maybe re reset here. I don't know if that's... Oh! Oh my god. I pressed the wrong button. I was trying to sharpen. Oh, holy shit. Well, it's really easy to hit the Dragonator, guys. I distracted myself with talking. But yeah, when he rages for the first time, he's going to do the stupid long swim. And then you can get the Dragonator hit, and it's very satisfying. And now... Oh my god. This is pain. I don't know how much damage it is. You can look it up in the damage formula guide. It's a lot. Oh, well, the worst... This is the worst part. He just keeps going. I've given up. You know, I haven't actually seen this in a long time. This is a, uh, this is what they call content, right? Throwing for content. Is he gonna do a downward uh, charge? Oh, he's just doing a stupid water water gun. That was really not that interesting. I can't get a, over there. Um, since I'm throwing for content, why don't I? 
is there underwater ballista ammo here? So normally I just poke him. Wait, isn't there a gather spot here? Oh, here. Is this ammo? Or is it rations? Oh, hi! What the heck? Wait, he hit me? Hey! Okay. Um, I'm still like 95% certain I'm gonna get a repel. It's not that hard. But, uh, yeah, this is gonna take longer. <laughs> I can't believe I pressed the wrong button. I don't know if you guys believe me about how hard it is to narrate your thoughts while, we're play while you're playing, but... I mean, yeah, that was a disaster, which you just saw happen. Yeah, fucking horn. Okay, so guard plus one lets me... Yes, yeah, you can counterattack. Believe me when I say if you ha do not have guard plus one, that is not counterable. You can test it for yourself. What? Oh, wait, no? I tried to counter, What? I don't know what came out there, that was weird. It looked like I got an attack and then I bounced, but I should have been in counter stance. Uh, I don't know. Don't know, guys. Just another thing to pile onto the farce that was this hunt when I missed the Dragonator. Okay. Now I'm bouncing. A lot. Go after the beard. Um, oh, I didn't mention his weakness. He's weak to Thunder. You know, you would hope so, because I'm bringing that. And with Thunder and Dragon equally, for some reason a lot of monsters in Try are... Like, those two elements are sort of intertwined, for the most part. So Thunder really takes a backseat to Dragon, because... Not because Dragon is inherently better, but because Alatrion weapons are Dragon. And Alatrion weapons get a humongous purple bars and huge damage, so, you know, it's just... It makes the Lalage Cruise weapons really dumb. That's why I was saying, um, probably come here with Door Spear Yellow. You won't... You're not gonna miss out on Amphitrite, I think. Like, the Door stuff is basically a high rank weapon. It's just a high rank weapon that dead ends. For the, um, advantage of you being able to use it earlier. I still have to use these. I don't... Do I have speed setup on here? I think I do. Okay, we'll go here. I have time here, thanks to speed setup. I don't have small barrel bombs, apparently. So we'll just, uh, stab it. Ow. <laughs> you can roll that. I tried. Oh god, again. You have to be facing the head for the roars, so like this. It doesn't have to be completely face on, you can be kind of maybe perpendicular, but yeah. You have to at least try. Just try. <laughs> oh, it was that easy. What the heck? It was 16 minutes and I missed the Dragonator, guys. This is the Repel quest. Okay, there you go. So no Crooked Horns for me. That's, um, that's going to be hell. I'm going to be... F <laughs> I don't even know if I want to record the chill session where I grind the stupid Deep Dragon Gem and the, um... And the Crooked Horns. Because you need it for the endgame Helio set. You don't need you don't need it for the low-rank Helio set. So I guess I'll go over like what you should and shouldn't make too. Oh. I have pings on Discord. What are pings on Discord? Oh. Okay, um, enjoy the ending movie, guys.
Oh, it's still going. Thank you for playing. I have played this game forever, and I will continue to play. Um, yeah. Oh, I got a tail. That's good. I didn't get a fur. I didn't get any horns, and I didn't get any gems. That's, uh... Yikes. Big yikes. Okay, um, we get the Barbarian Shark when Argosy comes back. That is a big deal. That's why I wanted to do this. So I guess I'm still not going to switch Hexag Nactor because I don't want to farm in Zadius. Sorry, guys. It's... Oh, that run tilted me. I do like the the Zadius switch axe. It looks so cool. I love it. I love the fur on it. I love the, the luminescent blue coloring on it. I like the way it looks when it's broken apart. That's not true for a lot of switch axes. I think a lot of them look like crap. Like the bone one. And the Baroth one, I think it looks like crap too. Um, okay, I need to grow cactus flowers. I picked up that one from that high rank hunt. Okay, if they can go um, extra far, I'll put them on the treasure tracker. Oh, my numbers are very nice. One five, one five. Uh, okay, I wanted to look at the forges. <laughs> I didn't even lock the new forges. Oh lord. I guess is the horn the first item or something? Yeah, that's not it. Yeah, I don't. I don't even have any of it. Okay, what do we do now? Checking the time. Okay, it's already been half an hour because that cinematic took forever. Hmm, frustrating. I guess we'll just do it in a few parts. I don't want to break it up. Do not want to break it up. Golly, okay. I decided. Oh, I decided. It's funny, I could, I could make this now if I had a luminous organ from the thing. I said I would recommend... Oh, that actually costs a plate. And three horns. Oh, that's so irritating. Okay, I would just wait for red then. I would wait for red. The yellow upgrade is stupidly expensive. Mm. <laughs> Alright. I'm doing c here, guys. I'm, I'm just doing c -Adius. We'll try the Ancient Mask, like the game intended for us to do. Oh, I can empty the box of whetstones. I do want to do that. Decisive battle. Um, very, I think, almost impossible I get a kill here. My weapon's not maxed out, and I have no damage armor skills. You, you can one-cycle it, it's not that hard. But with my gear, I'm not getting that to happen. So we're just going to go for the repel. Hope we get some goddamn horns this time. That'd be nice. Oh, I didn't check the armors. Oh, I forgot um, small barrel bomb again. <laughs> More up. I'm not good at changing my position in the Y axis when I do underwater hunts. Um, I'm getting owned by Lagia Cruz a lot when I bow gun, adrenaline bow gun, because sometimes the hip check, I don't know, I just find myself checkmated. I can't get around it. 
And I'm wondering if I spend more time going up or down in the water, maybe I can avoid that situation. Or maybe I swim to the spot that I know is kind of safe. It's, it's this weird spot kind of close to him. But, like, being in melee... Oops. Oh, I can't... Uh, yeah. Being in melee, like, automatically puts me in the spot. I'm used to it. But f from, like, a little farther away, I actually don't know where to go. It's kind of weird. I have very bad spatial awareness. I'm just, like, really stupid. It's amazing I even play this game. No, no, no. Ah, I was too busy bouncing. I should sharpen. What am I doing? Yeah, I'll make a door spear R. I think. Because I don't even remember the last time I used Amphitrite. It's just like a collection weapon. I'll make it for collection when I get there. Funny, if I had uh, the two wyvern stones, I could make it and just tell you, hey, this is basically door spear yellow. Because I think it is. It really is. Oh my god. The camera. What? I had the shield up. Uh, sometimes the facing is wrong. It's very particular about facing, just like blocking roars. Um, there's one attack in particular that's really screwy with the direction. It's uh, the bear off like, little head whip. That one is super screwy. Hey, can I get this one? Okay, I can. I'm on the wrong side of the head. I should be poking the beard. Oh, god. <laughs> And you know what would really help if, um... So, this quest is broken into two. If you don't kill it the first time, you can just repel it. And then it... You can start the fight again. It retains all the damage you did on it, like, in terms of the body part bro breaks. If you... And it starts with a minimum HP. So if you exceeded the starting HP that he has for the second half of the quest, he just goes back to that amount, whatever it is. So, like, say... I don't know. Say it's, like, 500 HP, for example and say you got him to 300 and then the quest timed out and you repelled, then instead of starting at 300, he'll start at 500. Otherwise, he'll start with whatever you left him at when you repelled him. So uh, this is, yeah, like I said, this is going to be a repel. I'm not going to be able to kill with this. And yeah, you can see it's, it's just a big punching bag. Um, with regard to weapons, I, I just recommend Lance. Don't don't use anything else. Probably, you know, if you're good at longsword, I bet uh, I bet that would work. Yeah, yeah, I, I bet longsword would be fine. I just lance it. Because you could, like I said, you can um, just chunk through all of his head shakes. And the head shake is pretty wide ranging, so if you're coming in here with like Thunderclap Plus, and you're just smashing away, I don't know if you're going to be able to get out on time Like once you see the animation start up. You have to like know that it's coming earlier than that. So it's extra burden on you. I spent too much time hitting his scalp, so... Right, that weird thing. That's the second time I've seen it today. And I, like I said, I don't even remember it. Okay, there it is. I'm not going to swing onto it because he's just going to come here and then I'll be chasing it some more. I wonder if I can bomb it. I saw a solo of this with a pure bow gun. And I mean, it was, a, it was high rank, right? So the guys like either heroics or adrenaline with like a chaos wing. Devil's Grin, probably Blizzard Cannon. I don't know what the final piece was, but that looked pretty legit. But of course, that was high rank. I can't say I would recommend trying Pierce on it in low rank, but maybe you can. Maybe you can. Like, 
the head is such a well I was gonna say Berazuka deviation probably doesn't hurt you but the range is compressed so tight that you have to be so close that it feels weird like you're gonna have a 0.3 firing range instead of 0.6 and 0.6 is already close hmm maybe raffling gun raffling gun looks pierced too yeah I don't know guys <laughs> jagged fire raffling gun Thunder Cruise or something. Now I want to try. But you have to bring ammo combines, which is also annoying to get in low rank. There's just so many low rank things that are frustrating. Also wish you could snap the horns early. That would be nice. Then you could... uh. Just save and quit earlier, or not save and quit, reset earlier. To know if your run is giving you crooked horns or not. And yeah, I think it's a 50% crooked horn carve, so that was a 25% I got nothing. <laughs> Get him, Cha Cha. Hit him with your old man walking stick. Thanks for the buff. Yeah, I'll take care of him. That was my uh, my wife and my kid. Yeah, tail break here. Oh my god. I wonder if this is a different fight from the uh, repel only. Like, does he have different numbers? Because honestly, that repel was ridiculous. Like I said, I, I don't feel like I put that much damage on it. I missed the dragon here. I bet this one like is tougher. I bet the Cadius is tougher. All right, restock there. Tasha has last stand, so he's not going to be refilling my oxygen if he goes away. Okay, I'm not getting aware on this. Guard plus one lets me do that. If you get the straight one, you know that um, it was going to be a full stun. Encounter that, by the way. That's why. That's why Lance. Although you could say that for every monster where you Lance, like that's why Lance, because you can counter that. It's basically the reason. <laughs> I remember, um, back in the day, when I was farming deep dragon gems, I would intentionally not one cycle it. So like, I would maybe pound at it until like 15 minutes, and then just far caster back, make some stakes, and then just go do something else. And when I hear the fanfare, then I come back. And, you know, collect my rewards. And the reason for that was just to double up the rewards I got for for the um, Cadius hunts. Because I could come back and kill it in like 5 minutes flat. It's not a good strategy for Crooked Horns, but... Oh! I interrupted the big swim. Is he still going to do it, actually? I don't know. Let's see. I think he is. 
Oh, he's not. Oh, I'm gonna miss the uh, guaranteed Dragonator. I can still probably get it randomly, but... Or I could press the wrong button, <laughs> like I did last time. Yeah, maybe don't uh, stagger that. That's interesting. I didn't expect to. Oh, oops. I didn't see what he was doing. Should probably lure him over to it. He's kind of pushing himself backwards. Yeah, see? Okay. Yeah, I did it. I did the dodgy dodgy. Okay, let's see if I want to save and quit. Or reset. Alright, I got one. So I'm good. I, I settle for one. One is good. Guys, don't... If you get another one, great. Oh, I got two. Alright. So, we're back to even. That's not how probability works, but we are back to even. I have the average amount of crooked horns I could expect to get for um, snapping two of them and carving twice. Uh, I just hope I can get one Dragonator. Oh, snap the tail. Um, I never get more than one Dragonator per fight anyway. I'm not sure it's possible to get more than one. So if I just get one at any point, I'll be happy. And yeah, when you come back with Latran Gleam, you're definitely not going to get more than one because, well, you're g it's going to be dead. And face the head for the roars, but don't whiff everything. Pro tip, don't whiff your attacks. Really... Tricky information, I know. I should put it in my guide. Don't whiff your attacks. I wonder if I can stop rush this with the... Oh, I gotta try. He's coming from the wrong angle, but I... Oh, oh no, 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 no. Oh, let's do this. If I whiff this one, that's fine. This is gonna be epic. If I miss or if I hit, it's gonna be epic, so... Yeah, look how much time this just wastes. It's so stupid. Damn it. <laughs> okay, oops. It's not like the um, gen Dragonator that takes some time to come out. Alright, two Dragonators whiffed. Oof. But the funny thing is, it probably won't cost me any time because I have to wait for the clock to run out for the repel anyway. And like I said, there is no way I'm getting a kill. So. I've, I'm 0 for 2 with Dragonators, but I swear to you guys, it's really easy to hit. <laughs> you just gotta believe me. Just uh, do as I say, not as I do. I'm a parent, so I have to prepare that line for sure. And that'll convince the kid. Oops. I know I've gotten a... Oh, that sucks. I know I've gotten a one-cycle kill with Undertaker and Alloy. Just Undertaker and Alloy armor. So I know that number is possible. I don't think I was might pilled Probably not. I don't really know. Let's get... Show off the... Cha-Cha uh, Oxygen feature, although he's recuperating right now, so he won't be showing up. Oh, he's back. I think I'm water blight, so I have no stamina. Yeah, this, uh... You know, if you want to bring water blocks, he's, that's not such a bad idea. At some point, I might just far cast her out and AFK and <laughs> go play with my kid. I gotta go hug him right now. Uh, I think I still need damage on this guy. Just a guess. Cha Cha's firing his little things. Wait, you're gonna give me air or what? 
I think he also doesn't listen to you when he's raged. No, no, he's raged. He's not giving me air, though. He doesn't do what I want when he's raged. Okay. We're drowning! I'm like a blitzball player in FFX. I can hold my breath for like 45 minutes. Uh, oh, I must need to sharpen or something. Oops. Totally forgot. That one also takes guard to go through. I know this very well because I'm used to fighting it with zero guard. Oh! Oh wait, what's he doing? I thought he was going to do the big swim again for the Dragonator, which I don't have. So it's good he's not. You can block that, but you're going to be hit by the water blight afterward. But, you know, better than eating a hit, probably. Oh, gotta get out of here. Hmm, I regret not building Baroth here. I would adrenaline this fight. minutes? Okay, 10 more minutes of this crap. Oh, cool. Probably hitting the wrong hit zone. I really should look this up. I'm pretty sure it's the beard that's best. You can see I take this fight very seriously. It would speed up the one cycle kill, though. Yeah. Yeah, these surf movements... From Loggy and Cadius, they're so annoying. They're just a waste of time. Oh, let me try on. Um, I think this, did I put away the underwater ballista ammo? I didn't. Let's uh. Oh, hi. I didn't even. I have no idea where you are. Let's have some fun. Although I should drag him out. <laughs> I can't shoot it from up there. Is making him float upwards because he's scratching against the back of it. Is that a hit? Oh, the tail is not an active hit hurt box there. Fun. Thank you. 
How much time? Okay, when the clock ticks five, I'm out of here. I'm gonna go tend with my kid and wait for this thing to go away. He can only entertain himself for so long. <laughs> and I'll probably end this segment. Yeah, I'm not sure if I'm going to show off the Cadius farming. I guess I should, because I wanted to make everything about this character um, recorded. Oh, Cha Cha's gone forever. Rip. I should probably put him in, like, Fluffy Mass with Gatherer to help to have him get a carve. That's probably the best thing he can do. Actually, will you go uh, let me hit a Dragonator hit? Oh, no, he's not. Nope, he is. Can we be one of three? Let's go for one of three, Dragonators. Where's the fast forward button on the emulator? <laughs> He's calm again, but I'm still gonna go go play with him. It's better than this. Look, guys, I did it. Shocking. Poof. Bro, oh, how are you talking to me? You're dead.
Can you chill, boo? How much time left? 25 seconds. Hi. <laughs> High five. High five. Yeah. All right. Jobu luck. Ah, uh, no. Fur? Oh, tail, yeah. Still no? Oh, that's a fur up here. Two furs. Okay. Come on, Argosy, give me your sword. Oh, nice. Okay, we'll do that and treasure tracker. fight with the kid in my arms. Do I not have gather? Oh, I didn't buy it yet. Blurred. Another shock trapper. Oh, burpee! You're burpee. Feline Carver. You'll say. Oh, I don't get an extra carver off the horn. Poop. Oh, let's let's pack those. <laughs> I swear it's not me making that sound, guys. All right, I should have some stuff now. You'll see. Um, there it is. Two crooked horns. There you go. Immediately they can go away. There's nothing there for whatever reason. Sea Striker. <laughs> 210, 270. Actually, does it have a second thing on the path? I'm making that. Oh, there's more! Oh, I didn't know that. Oh, that's neat. <laughs> Oops. Windows. Windows, please. Okay. I guess this is the final piece of quote unquote info on CADS. You just, um, if you're in phase two, Chacha will even guide you. This is the point you jump off. And this point is way different from the other point, which is like 10 feet to the left, because apparently. Yeah, that's just how far apart they are. You'll get to come here. Like, how far is this jump for the, for it to go this far? 
horizontally. I still forgot small barrel bombs. So I really hope Argo sees coming back. Did I get him? Oh, I really hope I did. That's a lot of damage. Those bombs, bombs hurt. I wonder why I didn't get water blooded. It's because he's not angry. Oh. Jobu. Probably missed it because he's not angry yet. Yeah, so I was like kind of perpendicular to his head and I still got the guard off. I feel like that might be the break point. I think if you're any more than like that 90% curved, then you are not getting it. Yeah, eat your ball. Dragonator it? Famous last words. Said by a person who missed the Dragonator. Also, thank god for this um green sharpness. How much do I have? Oh, that is so much better. I mean not not even like I'm not even talking about the raw and the elemental improvement. That is just so much better. Obviously, all put together, this is just a way better weapon. Joby, you dropped your ball. There you go. There you go. <laughs> he loves throwing his toys on the floor. Hey. High five. High five. Right there. <laughs> I know, it's pressing buttons. I always just come here because he's going to turn the head. And then we can re uh, reposition here. Oh, do that too. There's the water plate. It was just far enough away that it didn't matter. Oh my god, he's really clawing my buttons! Jello! Ah! Ha! Ha! Surprised he hasn't hit anything yet. Oh my god. Oh! <laughs> this is a whoa, Jabu. Yeah, you're having a good time. <laughs> oh no, my camera. That was him. <laughs> okay, this is me again. Oh, he's pressing the attack button. Yeah, Jabu, hit A. Hit A. Smash, smash. Mm. Well, how much 
much longer does it have to go? I kind of expected it to be dead by now. Hi! Well, I actually used up all the green. Crazy. Seven minutes already. Six and a half minutes. It is crazy how much distance that covers underwater. That was not my target. Yeah, get him, Joby. Get him. Get him, get him. Loves pressing buttons. Oh, don't press the home button, though. Microsoft, Microsoft programmed their fucking controller to do some fucking bullshit garbage. He's, he's, he's on the camera stick. He's constantly turning it. Yeah! Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Last charge sucks, guys. It does, though. <laughs> Can we get a seven cards instead of six? Be very welcome. Carve for me, Jobu. Oh, Cha Cha's carving. Four. Whoa. Five. Six. Deep Dragon Gem. Ah, oh, I didn't even get a carve. 50%. He's smiling. <laughs> I got fur. Hi. I forgot to register, didn't I? Oops. Yeah, why not? Just for fun. All right, this video is an hour. Hopefully I get Barbarian Shark and then I end it here. So that's the CADS fight. I didn't mean to highlight it, but I'm going to have to farm it a lot. It's pretty typical and try. If you want the armor, which you do, and the weapons, some of them, there it is. For whatever reason, Loggy is the one that features a weapon in every, um, every weapon class, but not Cadius. Cadius just gets a few, and they're really weird. They're super weird. Okay, so you can't upgrade this in low rank, because you see it takes the Wyvern Stones. But, uh, yeah, that's pretty cheap to upgrade. Except, you know, except for the stones. I'll get those eventually. Those happen. Now I have a longsword to fight, um... To fight, what's his face? Nactor, Nactor. Okay, where's, he? uh, Selene? Yeah, that's right. So what is this? 3-5, okay, yeah. Yeah, Jobu? Alright, I'll forge this next time. See you guys, thanks for watching.